Hey y'all. Right now you guys, I have decided to get out and about because I have a few errands I need to run or whatever. And so I just left my house not long ago. First I went to the dollar store because I needed a damn broom and some more body wash, some more Dove body wash, which I just threw in the back seat. Then I just left the gas station or whatever. So right now you guys, I am on my way to the nail shop. It's just one of those gloomy little days or whatever. The sun's not out, honey. And just let me tell you, if you are not from the midwest from missouri it is cold as shit out here today you guys i believe today is october 26th tuesday october 26th now tonight me and the hubby are going to have tacos but taco t -t 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 tuesday and yeah <laughs> so Right now, you guys, I am on my way to the nail shop. I'm not sure if you guys watched any of my previous videos, if you know it or not yet, but spoiler alert, I am going to be Harley Quinn, you guys, this year for Halloween 2019, bitches, or whatever. And um, yeah, you guys, right now, currently, as you can see, my nails is like this pretty 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 green color you know harley quinn's nails uh one hand is blue one hand is red i have shit to do after halloween so i really don't want to be walking around looking crazy like that you guys so i've decided either i have to get like an all red color um or all blue color and last time i was here at the nail shop i saw this really really pretty blue color that was kind of similar to uh, how they are now you know once i get my uh polish on my nails you guys i get like this unicorn dust that they spread over my nails or whatever so as you can see you guys right now my nails are like this green color so i just put up to the nail shop which which isn't too far from my house well a hopefully it's not too packed in here because i don't want to be here all damn day but it is early as fuck i wanted to get here before one or two o'clock because the lady who does my nails her name is lisa and that heifer is known for leaving early so i wanted to catch her before she leaves if she is here a and b i just want to get the shit done and out the way before it gets too late in the evening because i still need to go to like the grocery store and i was thinking about sliding by alta or maybe sephora and I also want to swing by Target today. Um, so, yeah, I'm not going to vlog once I get in here, you guys, into the nail shop. But I am going to go in here really, really fast to see if she is here. And um, instead of coffin shaped, I probably get stilettos. Just have her cut my nails into a stiletto shape. Probably get this really, really pretty blue color that I've seen. It's not as dark as the blue that Harley Quinn had or whatever. But I'm not going to be the comic book or the movie Harley Quinn. I'm going to be hood Harley. So, bitch. You already know what that means. That means doing shit my way, my motherfucking way. And so, yeah, uh, with that being said, you guys, I'm going to run in here really, really quickly and see what it do. So, I will check back in with you guys as soon as I am done. God damn <laughs> it, I hate when people drive this slow. My goodness. Anyway, I'm a little, you know what I'm saying? frustrated right now uh y'all because i just left the damn nail shop and as you guys can see i have officially got the God damn. as i was saying i just had to adjust my camera really really quick you guys but as you can see i have officially gotten the shape of my nails changed they were coughing now i have stiletto and I also got a polish change. They were like this green with the shiny unicorn on top of them, you guys. Now they're like this blue. It's really, really cool blue that I like a lot. So, yeah. If this bitch don't quit, get... Why are you riding me like you stupid? What is wrong with people? Hey. I ain't about to ruin my whole little afternoon and I'm not even Anyway, like I was mood. saying, y'all, I have just officially left the nail shop. Again, like I was telling you guys before, I actually went into the nail shop. I plan on being Harley Quinn this year, Halloween. And I just had to get a polish change because, like I said, one of her nails, on one side of her nails is blue and on the other side, on the other hand, it's red. But I ain't trying to be walking around like that after Halloween. Let me get over for this bitch pissed me off. I'm not trying to be walking around like that after Halloween, so I just decided to go ahead and get a full set of just all blue nails, you guys. And, um... 
telling you the way people drop it today about to make me snap and i only want to have to do it because i just got my nails done but i will break every last 10 of, every last 10 of these motherfuckers on her ass okay but yeah uh, so right now i'm just trying to do the last uh little finishes and touches you guys that i need to do i guess to complete my overall look and my costume for halloween again like i said today it's tuesday october 26th so we only have a couple of days until halloween which is thursday yeah so i just left the nail shop and unfortunately i spent more than i had planned to um not saying that i need a lot of money for when i go to the mall because i'm only going into one store you guys because I already got everything else I need for the most part as far as my whole outfit or whatever, but I still need um, accessories. And so I'm gonna slide past the mall really, really quick just to run a Hot Topic to see what they have. But unfortunately, my damn feel, my polish changed, and um, getting the shape of my nails changed, you guys, ended up coming up to like 40 fucking dollars. And now I'm on my way to go meet the hubby. <laughs> really really quickly because the bitch has gotten low on funds now she done took all my damn coins almost and uh because i only had like 50 or 60 dollars but i'm like i don't want to drive all the way to the mall which is like a 20 or 30 minute drive from where i am now just to end up falling short on money or something i might see that i need you know what i, I mean i'm on my so, way to go meet the hubby right now yeah it's like i said to get a little more money a few extra dollars or whatever and after i leave from over here you guys i am going to swing to the mall really really quickly just to see again like i said what hot topic have in specific i am looking for like a choker because you know uh harley quinn had a choker on that said pudding and stuff like that with the gold earrings and things of that nature but to be honest with you guys gold is really not my thing gold is really not my color so i'm looking for silver like i'm gonna have to switch up my outfit a little bit to you know what i like and what fits me so i'm just gonna be kind of like a hood harley quinn or whatever but yeah i want to do silver like silver and black i want to all black choker with like silver studs or silver spikes or something like that on it you guys and maybe like a bracelet to match it since i'll have the glove on my left hand i'm just kind of looking for some bracelets or something to throw on my right hopefully something that matches That's the choker about it, you guys again like i said i'm on my way to go meet the hubby right now to pick up to pick I can't even fucking talk straight. But to pick up a few extra dollars. Come on, come on. Like, sheesh. I don't know. Shout out to my nail tech, Lisa. She does an amazing, amazing, amazing job. I love her so fucking much. But honestly, in my opinion, you guys, when you go to somebody and they know that you love their work a lot, I don't know. I just feel like today she over fucking charged me. And I don't like this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not a broke bitch and I can afford what I like and what I'm trying to get and what I'm trying to do. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it's just all about feeling like somebody kind of trying to play you or hit you over the head for a price that you know is kind of like ridiculous or too fucking much. So yeah, I didn't like that shit at all. So I'm gonna have to check that bitch or ask that bitch ahead of time. You know what I'm saying? Next time I go before she actually do my nails, like how much is this gonna cost? Because $40 was a little steep. Like just for some polish and a feel. Like bitch, no, we not doing that. So this might be the last time my, my ass get some shiny ass unicorn type nails you know what i'm saying because she just, i feel like really 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 overcharged me like that was way too much money 40 dollars for some nails and then it's not like i got a full brand new set or anything like that you know what i mean so yeah that bitch gonna have to seek me next time oh yeah okay. i'm about to be pulling up on his ass here in a minute or whatever on my little car ride to the mall you guys i'm not gonna vlog i'm not gonna hold you i'm not gonna talk to death and talk and chew you guys ear off or anything like that so i'm gonna pull up on him really really quickly get some extra money um then i am going to just shoot over to the mall really really fast so i can go to hot topic see what they have or whatever and then while i'm over that way as well you guys have to run to walmart to pick up some groceries because again like i said tonight we are having uh tacos me and the hubby are having tacos since today is taco tuesday 
MICJ So Cool Voice. <laughs> Shout out to the Wolf Pack and the Cool Kids. I do watch their fucking channel. I love them so, so very much. Especially Royalty. I think she is so fucking pretty. Royalty is beautiful. And right now, as we all know, she is expecting twins. So I just want to bless it, their entire family. I pray that everything goes well with them, you guys. I love watching their channel so, so fucking much. They are so entertaining. They keep me laughing so much. I love watching the So Cool Gang. I'm pulling up on him right now as we speak and then after I have a little interaction with him or whatever you guys I am going to catch back up with you guys as soon as I come out of the mall so I can let you guys know if there was a hit or miss oh railroad track so I can let you guys know if it was a hit or a miss or not and I will catch up with you guys as soon as I come out of the mall okay his ass ain't even here. Like, babe. I'm not trying to just be sitting here. I'm not trying to just be sitting at this plant. Wait, no, his ass to pull up. Like, no, where are you? I don't see his ass yet, so. Maybe I should pull on this side of the street. But he need to come on, because I ain't trying to be out all day, and it's already 2 o'clock, and I still got to go back home, wash dishes, cook this hamburger meat, chop up these tomatoes, and get this dinner ready for tacos tonight. So, his ass need to come on before I start running low on motherfucking energy, because the bitch is tired. A bitch is tired in my city girl's voice. I'll check back in with you all later. Shit. I'm about to call his ass right motherfucking now and see where the fuck he's at. You know, he's talking about he got to go to an ATM. Like, who walks around with no cash on them? Like, fuck. Who walks around with absolutely no cash on them? Like, that's crazy. Hello? Babe, I'm here. Are you close by? To pull up. Okay, bye. He doesn't sound too happy, bitch. Oh, okay, beauty gang family. So, I have officially just left the mall, you guys. I went in Hot Topic, as you can see. And I got lucky because they had exactly what the fuck a bitch needed. They had exactly what the fuck a bitch was looking for. And so uh, that worked out perfectly for me. Um, and they got like some really, really cute sale going on. It's like you buy one thing, you get another thing free. Or you buy two things, you get two things free. Yeah, I bought two chokers just to wear to the club just because cause I'm such a fucking choker freak. You guys are just bouncing all around and all over the place. I am so sorry about this, you guys. I don't know why the car ride is so bumpy. Ooh, road kill. Oh, my God. And then, um, I guess she was like, uh, what are you looking for? Anything in specific? I was like, yeah, chokers. You know, just because I like chokers, A and B. I needed one for Halloween. And she was like, well, what are you going to be this year? And I was like, Harley Quinn. She was like, we have putting chokers. I was like, shut up. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do something different to kind of make my outfit my own. You know, be like a hood Harley. <laughs> a, because I'm black and B, because I'm kind of piecing my own shit together. And I don't really like gold. You know, like in the movie, you guys, all of Harley Quinn's accessories were gold. Like pudding was gold. Her earrings were gold her uh, bracelets and things were gold and she had gold in her belt or whatever but I don't really do gold I'm not a fan of gold I'm kind of more of a silver type bitch and my boots that I'm wearing with my costume this year you guys are silver silver and black well they're only black at the top but they're all silver of course and I was like that would look right but I got lucky you guys because they had putting in silver I was like oh my fucking god you gotta be fucking kidding me they had pudding you came to get me pudding they had putting in silver. And I gotta get into character because I gotta try to actually talk like Harley. <laughs> yeah. They had putting in silver and black. So, bitch, that was a motherfucking plus. And then also on top of that, you guys, they even had the earrings because, you know, Harley wears, I hate riding past uh, motorcycles. Harley's earrings were uh, paper clips. And so she showed me this really small pair. And I was like, no, I'm just passing those. Those are too small ones, something a little bit bigger. Bitch. No, she didn't find me a pair that was a little bit bigger, honey. So I am right on the motherfucking money now, you guys. With my entire outfit, my entire costume, my whole entire 
complete look, baby. I am like right on the fucking shmoney now, y'all. So, yeah. I don't know where I'm gonna get off at on this highway because there's so much construction going on right now. And I gotta go pick up Hubby. He just called me while I was at Walmart telling me he's off of work. So I gotta go pick his ass up real fast, real quick. And yeah, guys, I got like eight to 10 bags in the back seat. I just left Walmart. I bought me a couple of pair of sweatpants. Um, A, because it's fall and it's cold as fuck out here. And B, I need some bottoms to go with some of my pink shirts. The t-shirts I bought from the pink stores that I showed to you guys uh, in my previous video. So if you have not watch that or check that out yet beauty gang please make sure that you so do. now it is time for my ass to go home and do my duties i'm about to go home first things first i gotta wash fucking dishes which i hate but whatever so i gotta wash dishes and then of course after that just prepare dinner for me and hubby and yeah like i said today's tuesday so it's taco day we will be having tacos tonight so yeah so. you guys i just wanted to give you a brief update on everything that i got and everything i accomplished really really fast and hopefully my camera doesn't shake that much now since i'm off the highway but it looks like it's still shaking like a motherfucker and i don't know why but uh yeah so right now you guys i am just riding it's gonna be a hot little second before i get to him because i was just leaving like across town basically so yeah it's gonna be a while a nice little ride on my way to go pick up hubby this bitch is riding my ass i hate when people do that like get the fuck from behind me yo it's two more lanes bitch like use one dude and then you speeding up even more behind the car that you see I ain't going fast like people kill me when they do that bullshit i just don't get it and this bitch is steady switching lanes like she's going somewhere fast like i'm just highly irritated but anyway what was i about to say this bitch threw me off um, yeah, so, you guys, when I get home, I want to do it today, but sometimes I'll be distracted when hubby be at home because I don't like doing stuff in front of him because he just be all up in my business or whatever. And I don't need him knowing everything I bought and how many coins I spent. I'm going to do a full, complete layout for you guys of everything that I purchased, everything that I pieced together for my outfit for Halloween this year, you guys. It is so fucking cute. Let me see. Starting with the Harley Quinn uh, wig. I got the wig, and the wig was only 20 bucks, you guys, and it came with the little glove inside, so that was a plus. I purchased it from one of my local beauty supply stores here where I live. Even though they had the wig at Party City, it was busted, bitch, busted at her, uh, Party City. And like I said, where I purchased it from, the plus was it came with this like really, really cool glove, Harley Quinn glove inside. So I kind of got like two for 20 because I'm not trying to spend a lot of fucking money this year, which I ended up spending any fucking way. And then I got the Harley Quinn t-shirt that says Daddy's Little Monster for like $24.99. But you guys can do the math uh, as I'm telling you this shit. And then for Party City, I bought some stockings with like uh, the car things on them, the heart, the diamond, the club and stuff like that. Those were like $6.99 or $7.99. Then I also got the Harley went bad for party city that was $16.99 then i purchased uh these harley quinn socks from like this uh spirit halloween store that sells uh like halloween stuff those were i think like six or seven ninety nine then of course my boots i already had thank you jesus glory hallelujah to that because i didn't want to have to you know purchase a whole new fucking outfit so yeah what else do i have to go with my costume oh and then of course my accessories that i just recently purchased today you guys i'm not sure how much this choker was i'm gonna pull it out and see 12.90 for putting and the earrings were all oh, this tree is really really bumpy so you guys hold on The earrings were $6.90, you guys, so yeah, you do the math, honey. I paid a pretty good penny for my costume in total. And, oh, last but not least, you guys, my shorts. I didn't want to do the red and blue shorts because I didn't want to be walking around with my pussy out, A, because it's cold as fuck where I live. And, B, I just don't care for those little bitty tiny shorts that Harley Quinn wore. So I kind of made it my own, my outfit my own, like I said. I picked up these really, really cute sequins. Oh, excuse me. I picked up these really, really cute all black sequins shorts that I purchased for Party City as well, you guys. And those were $19.99. Oh, yeah, those were like and so. Yeah, bucks. I tried everything on. Everything fits pretty good. The whole outfit all together looks pretty, pretty fucking cool. I think for me to have not purchased everything at one store, or bought it or like in a package deal, or uh, since I wasn't able to like actually order my costume this year, I think I did a fucking pretty good, amazing job, honey, sweetie. What's big, sweetie? <laughs> 
oh, I think I did pretty good, y'all. But like I said, when I get a chance, even if it's not tonight, once I get home and get situated, because like I said, I got a lot going on and a lot of shit I got to do. So even if it's not tonight of me showing you guys everything that I purchased in my complete costume and my complete look, even if I don't have a chance to do that this evening or tonight before it gets too late, I promise to show you guys everything first thing in the morning because, of course, the day after that will officially be uh, Halloween. We come on fine people we driving it's horrible and of course the day after tomorrow is halloween and so i won't have time to show you guys everything piece by piece by tomorrow so i'm gonna try to do it before you know the actual day and i have the actual shit on oh bump oh don't make yeah you guys bump. that's that and i am going to show you babes everything and so of course the day of halloween you guys last but not least which is thursday i'm going to do my makeup that morning because i don't want to be all day doing stuff you know hair makeup getting dressed and all that shit even though the party until later on that night i'm gonna go ahead and start doing my shit early in the day so i can kind of a start fucking drinking and b just so i can be on time because a bitch like me is never fucking on time i'm always late and i kind of want to be able to meet up with the girl you know what i mean uh meet up with the ladies before you know everything gets too crazy so i'm gonna go ahead and get my shit together early y'all and just get dressed early so i might do a small little tutorial makeup tutorial on me doing my whole makeup, my Harley Quinn look, just so I can upload that content and that video to my YouTube, probably to my main channel. And then I'll, of course, vlog while we're out and about, getting drunk, acting a fool, and having a damn good time, you guys. I am going to vlog that on my uh, Beauty Gang TV so, channel. Yeah, again, I have two YouTube channels. Please make sure that you subscribe to both of my channels. The first one is my main channel, Miss Beauty Babe. And then my second channel is Beauty Gang TV. Please make sure that you subscribe to both of my channels, you guys. I really, really appreciate it. I love the support from you babes and <laughs> i love you all duh so yeah that's just about it for now you guys i'm going to wrap this up so a bitch don't have to spend all motherfucking night editing no long ass and video. i am just, just going to be riding basically for another good probably 10 or 15 minutes to pick up hubby from work and then you know once i get home i'll start doing my duties washing dishes cooking and all that good stuff and tending to him and relaxing and watching tv and taking a shower and a bath and washing my ass and all that good shit but again uh if i don't show you guys everything that i bought for my costume when i get home i will most definitely pick up this fucking camera and vlog first thing in the morning for you guys just so you can see everything oh so yeah babes that's just about it per usual you guys thanks a million for being here today thank you so much you guys for riding and doing this car chit chat baby and running around doing some errands and picking up a few extra things with a bitch yada that i mean and uh yeah i'll see you all later bye <laughs> bye babes Blue. okay you guys so uh, i am finally back at home beauty gang family uh, i just want to show you guys really really quickly my little layout of my halloween costume this year you guys so i am going to try to just run through this really really quickly first things first like i told you guys here is my good night harley quinn um from the suicide squad here is the bat you guys i got my bat from party city as you can see the bat says good night and then on the back of it which i love is the entire lullaby that she actually uh reads and sings you guys really can't see because i tried these on so i took the uh thing that came with it off but these are just a pair of fishnet pantyhose you guys and they're really really cool of course you'll see once i tried on it put my halloween costume on they actually have the uh symbol of each card on them like the the ace the diamond the club and the heart so these are really really cute these are really really cool i can't wait for you guys to see me with them on of course once i take pictures or whatever you'll see them and then of course like i said i wanted to do my outfit a little different i didn't want to wear the blue or red shorts and so i decided to get my own little these are shorts. A small and i got these from party city uh, and I believe my shorts were $19.99, but I'm just going to round it off to the nearest dollar. So say $20. My bat, you guys, I'm sorry. I'm just going to go back and tell you guys the prices that I paid for it as well. My bat was from Party City. My bat was $16.99. 
the pantyhose I also got from Party City. These were, I want to say $6.99, so about 7 bucks. And then I got my shorts, you guys, from Party City as well. Like I said, they were $19.99, so about 20 bucks. They fit really, really cute. I like them so much. My shirt I got from a store called uh, Spirit Halloween. It was, I actually still have the tag on here. So as you can see, you guys, my shirt was $24.99. So it says Daddy's Little Monster, of course, like one Harley Quinn had on in the movie Su Suicide Squad. And then of course here are my Harley Quinn Suicide, Suicide Squad socks. I will be wearing these over my pantyhose, you guys, over my fishnets, of course. And then with my boots, I think that style is really, and really, really cute. And then of course, really last but not least, I picked up my wig. Like I told you guys, they actually come with the glove. I picked up my wig, you guys. This is the glove that goes with it. I think that is so cute. And then here is my wig, you guys. I just purchased my wig from one of my local beauty supply stores. And it was only $19.99. And as you can see, it is exactly like Harley Quinn's was in the movie. And so, yeah, you guys, this is my wig. One side is red. The other side is blue. And so, yeah, I will be in full Harley Quinn mode, you guys. Come tomorrow. Come Thursday, because, of course, Thursday is Halloween. So, this is my entire outfit, you guys. So, I'm going to be hood Harley. That is my wig that I purchased from the store. And then, the like store. I was telling you guys, I got lucky. I got really, really lucky, you guys, when I went to Hot Topic. Because they did have the choker that I wanted, as you can see. Oops, that's the wrong one. Let's see. Okay, yeah. And I have the Suicide Squad choker that says put in. Love it so much. Can't wait to wear it. If you ever seen the Suicide Squad movie, you guys, then you know that Harley Quinn, her earrings or like safety pins and so got those as well so yeah i got pretty fucking lucky at hot topic you guys and here are the earrings that i'll be wearing for halloween which i love so much i think these are so fucking cute and don't get it twisted you guys i will be wearing these um throughout the year um just to the club and to the bars and with other outfits these are so cute these are so, so cool. yeah i just wanted to show you guys my entire harley quinn get up for halloween you guys i think it is everything i think it is so cute i had to go around like from store to store and piece my shit together and so i think i did a really 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 amazing job if i do say so myself and again you guys last but not least just to go ahead and wrap up and close out this video that is my harley quinn bat that says good night i got it from party city it was 16.99 there are my black stockings that I'll be wearing up under my shorts. There is my socks, my Suicide Squad Harley Quinn socks that will be on top of my stockings. And then, of course, my really, really cute pair of sequins black shorts that I'll have under my shirt that says Daddy's Little Monster. I got my shirt from a store called Spirit Halloween. And then, of course, I got my wig from my local beauty supply store. It was $19.99, which also came with the glove that I love. And I was lucky enough to snatch up my uh, choker last minute, you guys, from Halloween topic and as you can see it says putting and those are the earrings I will be wearing so I am all ready and set to go for my costume this year for Halloween you guys and I can't yeah. wait again I'll be wearing some silver boots unlike the black and white boots that Harley Quinn wears in the movie my boots are actually silver so I'm going to show them to you really, really quickly. And then I'll probably close out the rest of this video. So yeah you guys there are my boots that I will be wearing for Halloween. Here are my boots, you guys, that I'll be wearing for Halloween. They are so cute. So yeah, this, those are my boots, you guys, that I'll be wearing this year for Halloween with my outfit. So this is my entire outfit. This is my entire costume, you guys, in a nutshell. And I cannot wait until Thursday. It's gonna be so cute. Ew. <laughs> Yes, sweetie. Can't fucking wait. Okay. Alrighty, beauty game family. And last but not least, these babes, I decided to swing by Ulta Beauty, as you can see, while I was out because I needed a few things. Like, a bitch is always in need of a few extra makeup products or whatever. And so, yeah, I just thought I'd share them with you guys really, really quickly. 
see, I went in there and spent damn near my life savings. No, I'm just kidding. I did spend a nice pretty penny. My stuff came up to 86 bucks. I gave her 100 and got about $14 and some change back. But yeah, that's besides the point when like you're, you're really in need of shit. So let's just jump right into it, you guys. I didn't get much. Well, actually I did, but I just uh, wanted to show you guys really, really quickly that I got the new James Charles Morph palette. Well, it's really not that new, but it's new to me because I haven't used it yet. And so, yeah, I just need to really create a really, really good Halloween look for my Harley Quinn costume. And I know that James has some really, really great colors in here. And so, yes, babes, I had to have this palette. I had to get my hands on it, of course. I will probably be using this palette for the rest of this fucking year. Um, he has some really, really great colors in here, you guys. Matter of fact, probably for the rest of this year and half of next year. Because spring and summer, yes, like... He has so many great colors in here, you guys. Like, you cannot go wrong. And so, I didn't pick up the large palette, you guys, for $44. Instead, I just got the mini palette for $26. But they both have the same great, amazing colors in them. I understand that the eyeshadows are very pigmented. I will be doing a look. An overall uh, makeup look and a makeup tutorial, you guys, using this uh, palette. So please be on the lookout for that on my main channel, which is Miss Beauty Babe. If you have not subscribed to my main channel yet, please make sure that you so, do. So yes, you guys, I'm going to be I'm going to be using all these products. Um, of course, not only tomorrow for my Halloween look, which I will be transforming into Harley Quinn, but yeah, just for some more looks, you know what I mean? Like, we're going to be using the fuck out of this, sister, as James Charles would say, sister. So yeah, you guys, uh, and then next, of course, I was in need of some Real Technique brushes, and so I got the concealer brush to, uh, blend in the concealer on my eyelids, of course, before I actually apply the eyeshadow, and so yeah, a bitch needed that, and then I also picked up another Real Technique brush, you guys, because I need a brush really, really bad, um, for my setting powder, it says setting powder or highlighter, but of course, I'll be using mine for my setting powder, um, to catch all my fallout for my eyeshadows and whatnot and to just overall set my face so i was really 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 in need as of that. well as this you guys like oh my gosh i cannot wait to get my hands on this i have been dying to try this and use this you guys it is the mario badesco skincare facial spray and of course i got the pink one it says facial spray with ole herbs and rose water i really wanted to try a mist a facial mist a spray to moisturize my face before applying my uh foundation and my makeup you guys usually I just use some cream or like a really really great lotion that I have but I wanted to do something different and try to switch it up a little bit with my makeup routine so yes I picked up this you guys and I cannot wait to use this so again be looking out for me to use this you guys as well on my main channel we are going to try this bad boy out together and it smells so fucking beauty good. gang and so last but not least you got you guys I have been dying to try out one of these uh uh, NARS concealers like oh my god bitch first of all let me tell you you see how small this thing is this motherfucker cost me $30 like just for this small ass concealer you guys but she told me I can always bring it back if I need to or if I wanted to but yeah this concealer was $30 and that just like took my breath away I think that is ridiculous for some concealer but I went ahead and, and spent that little pretty penny that little coin on it or whatever because I have just been dying to try it out like every beauty blogger every youtuber everybody that does makeup damn near has has a NARS product a foundation a concealer or something and I have yet to try out a NARS product so I went ahead and treated myself you guys and purchased it but I am just praying to God with everything in me and my mind body soul and spirit okay that I actually like it because if not, you guys, I'm going to be highly disappointed. Like, that's a lot of fucking money for a concealer. And if you guys watch any of my videos, then you will already know that I'm used to using my LA Girl Pro Concealer as well as my Ruby Kiss. But I just feel like those are just kind of like so old and played out at this point because I have been using them for years. And again, like I said, beauty gang, I just wanted to try out something new. 
So, with that being said, you guys, these are the new products that I just recently purchased from Ulta. And please be sure, you guys, to check me out on my main channel, which is at Miss Beauty Babe. I will be doing a look, a makeup look, and a makeup tutorial, you guys, uh, using all my brand new makeup products. So, yeah, products. beauty gang, that's just about it for now, you guys. I just wanted to fill you in on all of that really, really quickly so you guys can know what's going on with me and just some of the new things that I recently purchased and to give you guys a sneak peek of my Halloween costume and who and what I'll be this year and so yeah I'll be doing a makeup look on my Harley Quinn like I said that'll be on my main channel and then when I get with the ladies when we hang out and actually go to the Halloween party that will be on my Beauty Gang TV vlogs channel and so yeah again please make sure you subscribe to both channels and as always beauty gang family thanks a million and thank you guys so much for being here today thank you for spending time with me and i will see you all later bye oh yeah you guys and this is the blue that i decided to get um, for Halloween to match my costume. I'll try to zoom in a little bit. I think it is so, 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 so pretty. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, I am all ready and set to fucking go. So yeah, that's just about it, you guys. And I will talk to you all later.